time. Okay, so the time is how the first thing I'll do is I'm just going to push that with my fingers and just tack it like that. Tack it on the inside as well. And then the top. And you see how I can manipulate the, the material. So you can have a little hole for a couple of seconds and then, then you melt around the hole and you fill it and then you just shape it. So once I've done that, we've got to think about strength as well, haven't we? In the air, just decrease that a fraction because I'm, I'm listening to the sound and I want it to be, I want to be in complete control. This is where the infill comes in. What I'm going to do is I'm going to increase the frequency as well up to about eight shots and I hold the pedal down. And what I like to do is I like to hold it down and work it like a paintbrush, like this. Can you see? Yeah. So I, I, I'm, I'm shaping this as well, which, which ultimately cuts down the amount of work afterwards. So you see you've got a, see you've got a gap there. Yeah. You see that gap? Yeah. Great for a laser gap because I can now fill that. Mm -hmm. 